Ну, Поэтому не то. Thing don't be good. Couple of days because I was uh, working on actually gathering the conscious. In the meantime, though, I did also talk to Sarai in camp. Yeah, gathering stuff and just wandering around. And she started telling me about something in her world that she needed help with. Like something besides the Flashmancer and everything, everything going on with that. So I have not done any of that yet. Uh, I've just been gathering the, the shells. But I think you get like one more from doing her quest. So uh, this was like my second to last. So I have 59 now. One more to go. But first things first. Uh, yeah, just gotta see what's up with whatever she's uh, she was talking about. So yeah, let's set up another camp, because the clue is for how we can progress with her storyline was, I think, in this, one of the stories from Teeks, because she had something and Teeks could, like, uh, yeah, observe the, the object with her magic book or whatever. Or Grimoire. Another thing that was also kind of interesting is I was talking to Rashian on the uh, on the ship, and for some reason, well, his puppet, I, I should say, but for some reason he did point towards the Skylands for some reason. Like there was even like a little star that appeared on the Skylands. But I've looked all over that place and I don't know why he was pointing me that way. So yeah, let's see what she has to say. The queen that was. Oh yeah, that was what she was talking about. I was... I hope Teeks will have something for us to go on. So yeah, that unlocked a new story within Teeks' arsenal. I did listen to all of the stories because I just wanted to have the achievement. Uh, I think it's the bottom one, the Cerulean Expedition. This one is special. It's an adventurer's log. An adventurer's log. Might want to take some notes. Okay. Joseph's log, Cerulean Expedition, day one. Okay. Let me get a notepad on. Expecting to feel fear so early on. I think we might just happen upon her, the queen that was. Still, she needs to be found, lest she gets, lest she get the jump on the pine. Even the sunken moon knows we've suffered enough from her betrayal as it, as it is. Three teams we are. The other two are led by Brochu and Elby. And it goes like this. Each team has a series of four directions to explore. Okay. Directions four days after which we backtrack for another four. And we compare notes. Okay, Brug 
Whose teams is... Let me note this. I don't know if it's important, but... Who is trying? Northeast. Southeast. South. And Northwest. Yeah. LB's team. Okay. She's going southwest two times. West again and then east. So my team we're doing north, northeast. North, east, north, east, okay. Log Charillion Expedition Day 9. Well, I'll be damned. It was obvious once I took a second look at the notes. Rohu said it felt for the first two days. Felt right for the first two days. Then something was amiss. Okay. So, four directions in four days. So, the four felt right for the four first two days. Put first two under it. Then something is missed. Will be recounted feeling lost the whole time. Save for day four. And everyone had more spring in their step. Okay. Let me just put four over. For me, I was right. Day three was something special. Okay. Okay, so, going by my notes, the bro brochure's first two, his first two was northeast and southeast. North, east. Correctly, east southeast. Oh. Again, northeast, north east. Just east, okay. So all of them have east in, in it. So northeast, southeast, northeast, east. Hmm. That speed ball ought to lead to her throne, but it lost power like all the others. So there ain't no way forward. But good thing that we restored the power. And seeing as I lost my entire team getting there here, so there ain't a way back either. That's it for me, I guess. 
If you are eating this, you must have found my belongings. Well then, let it be known. Josh was here. The end. That's sad. Let's go check out what this is all about. Like I was reading that story because it was also quite late so I was just roaming around trying to find these conscious. It's kind of sleepy so it all made no sense to me. I'm like, how the fuck am I supposed to figure this out? But after reading it again now, like, Four directions, four days, like one direction a day. Seems pretty obvious. Watch me be wrong and it not being obvious at all. Cerulean okay, Express. So left is west, right is east, up is north, and down is south, right? So up is north, east is to the right, so northeast is this one. Then we need to go southeast, which is then the bottom on the right. Then again northeast. Just check, check out what this one is. God damn it. Okay, cost me a bit of extra MP, but um, so yeah, northeast again. And after that, just straight up east. Then we should get there. There we go. Okay. Kind of afraid I would be wrong, but I guess not. Destination high, threat level high. Are you sure you wish to proceed? Yes. Okay, is this taking us? Kind of curious if I look on the map right now. Still says we are on Cerulean Island. Get a campfire here. You get a chest. Found one art artful gambit. That's a relic, right? HP minus 95%, enemies are invincible while casting, time to block, reduce damage to 1, reduce damage to 1, timed hits, bonus damage times 2.
Okay, so it's basically a glass cannon. Very low HP, but at least you do two times more damage when timed hits. Or is it like even more now? This is also a nerf. I think it's a buff since it's like in green. Yeah, this is like a challenge run uh, relic. Also, the only relics I still have on is like the fishing ones and uh, the parrot one and the uh, timing one that gives you like a little star. it would be like after this fight but it's just here that's the last one we got 60 we can turn those in let me just save again since I just gathered that let's just see what this whole queen of want is about this is it the throne of the Oh, the queen that was, not a want. He's not here then. Yeah, I see that thing there. The machine. She's here, alright. She's also like someone who got turned into a machine, but since they called her someone. Uh, since they called her a traitor, I'm guessing she was like fine with it. On your mark. I expect him some um, dialogue. Attack with Valer first. Get some of that live mana going. Okay. Disorient to delay that. And we can use this with Russia. Man, maybe I'm because it's been a couple of days, but I'm a bit out of practice with her whole, uh, with the whole timing of that attack. Decent damage too. Some light mana. 
use the gumbo. Wow, all those different body parts got hit. Ah, those things. I had no idea. Since we finally got hurt a little bit, let's use Lunar Shield. Heal that, heal that bit of damage back. Get a shield. Done got it. are basically a resistance to everything so it's not even worth uh, attacking them I guess I mean, it hurts, but it's not too bad. Combo. Yeah. Ultimate bonus for... All of a sudden, it's full too. Damn. Let's do a shield again. Five mana going on the floor, so we can actually buff ourselves with the uh, be fine since we are protected now. Does it only do that attack? Yeah, let me do that. Ultimate with Russia with Valer. And use the combo. The combo. Using a combo, the ultimate meter will fill up a whole bunch again. And the bullets are gone here. Before using the combo thing though, I kind of want to get some live mana going again. So just a single uh, target attack. Set up another shield, since we have the MP for it. already full again. Let's 
of mana going from. So let's just use his skills a bit more. So just tap the seal. Oh. And it's dead. The achievement is even got better of that. And a level up. Nice. Very nice. Can't even do HP anymore. <laughs> what would be better? Defense or magical defense? We can fight the Flash Mancer also. Because we all did like a whole bunch of extra stuff and it felt kind of weird to not be able to fight him. And I feel like he has more of a magical attack thing going for him. So I'll do magic defense. Since it's an option for him, attack. B. to still see someone with mana. Ah, sorry about that. Don't know if you can hear it, but it really sneezed for a second. But I'm surprised to still see someone with a mana point. Do the same for Zill. Maybe I'll alternate between the. This one. This also got unlocked. I almost forgot about this. Like, geez, that's what that was the whole point about doing all of this stuff. At long last, she paid the price for her betrayal. Thank you, my friends. You got it. So this was like the quest for her ultimate weapon. Famous daggers of legend detected amidst the rubble. Recommended action, loot and equip. Convenient. Oh yeah, I could use them. Star shards. I mean, that is a pretty cool name. Nothing left for us here. Lead the way. That is quite a boost. Plus 8 attack, plus 3 magic attack. I also feel like we're kind of really powerful at the moment. Like we're level 21, but in normal RPG standards that's not like that much, but I feel like kind of overpowered already. Yeah, 
maybe it's nothing compared to the Flash Mancer or something, but I don't think the couple of the last couple of bosses have actually given us a whole lot of trouble. The only one that gave me a bit of trouble was the Sea Slug in the Crustellion uh, arena fight because of the two chests. But once his ads were gone, like he yeah, was not that difficult. Also, the Elder Mist, that's like the only time we died. Just walk a random way and get to the exit. is done we can go back to our world so, yes it's the island Item was my most peculiar one. No idea what it's for. The rainbow star flew up and disappeared. Okay. Looked like one of those Teak's uh, story items. Oh. Good. That was the last thing. Did you see that? Oh well. Guess that one was a dot after all. Safe after that. Then let's go to the Morlands and check out what that is about.
Does this do anything now? I think it's getting ancient magic. Still the same thing. One thing I forgot to check, like what are all the requirements of all these things? Like we had three, three of them we could do, like this one, this one, this one I believe, or maybe four. Of them. Seems we have everything now. You know about this thing? Yes, the great alchemist told me about the chronophage while he was working on my living glass. Sean left us something? Chronophage is, a, is his parting gift to you. It was enchanted to activate in response to your initial deeds as up and coming guardian gods. Gift? Okay. Is it time travel something? Chrono? That's how he described it. I got the sense that he wished to take responsibility for something. Like for kidna kidnapping us as children. It should take us somewhere. All I know is how to open it. And that only Valer and Zeal and I can go. Are you sure this is safe? Yes. The Great Alchemist could have stopped you at any time if that had been his wish. How do we open this gift? You must provide the memento of a happy memory. Uh, the cookie jar? He said you would know. Ah, I knew it. It worked. We should go. We, sh we should go now while it's activated. Be safe out there. I'll be here when you return. No fucking way. Are we actually gonna be able to save Garl? Oh my god, I just got goosebumps from that. Well, let's not jump to conclusions. They're beautiful. What do you call them? Time shards. You always were the better artist. This is... Is it a vision? The Great Alchemist. Place an anchor in time so that you could return here. I know what my role is, but we must be quick. Is he gonna take his place? Don't you see? This is your gift. Your friend's life. I will take his place. You hurry and get him out of here. He's confident he can even take the hit, survive it. I thought he was like gonna die. Even then, I, I would still choose Garl over him. Not because I dislike his character, but he has been a soul that has been like adrift for so long in one place. He has lived who knows how long, or whatever form you would call that. Like maybe it's not even living, but still. But my will is strong, I can take the hit. Just act now before the diversion is over. Thank you. 
Just don't leave me buried under the tree for too long, okay? Courage, best. We'll be right with you. See you soon. Steady now. Is that? You about it? You did it, Carl. Don't just stand there, what are you waiting for? Girl, it's so good to see you. Is this real? It sure is. Okay, so it's not even like a girl from just that time point in time. Like he's been watching us all along. So he knows what we've been through up until this point. I'm so proud of you. Everything you accomplished. It's unbelievable. Hey, where's best? Oof, right, we should go now. Our reunion can wait. Are you well enough to travel? Never been better. Alright, let's go dig up my grave. Can't wait to meet my savior. Holy shit. Holy shit, I did not expect this. Sorry you had to wait all this time. I thought it'd be instantaneous or something. Anyway, thanks again, best. You really are the best, the best. Please don't mention it. No way, I owe you big time. Guys, there's so much I wish I could share. I'm not allowed to talk about what I saw on the other side. But when I came back, they said that they would grant me one wish. You pick a good one? Sure did, but it can't wait. I want to be the one cooking for the night. My wish demands a bit of an error though, so we don't have... So we don't have to go for it if we don't have time. I'll tell you at camp later if you want. Sounds good. God. A thing I'm maybe a bit missing from this is like an actual big emotional reaction. Like man, would you just burst down and break down in tears if like your best friend or someone you love like just came back? Maybe that's the warrior part of them, that's... They already made peace with his dad, but... Man! What a time, huh? I sure didn't have resurrection on my list when we started our adventure. It takes a story back to you. Seriously, though. It did get kind of scary. So this whole optional side quest, like, man, this has got to be like one of the best rewards I've seen for like doing all the side stuff that I have ever seen. Thanks for pulling me out of there. I know activating the Chrono Vage took a lot of effort. We'd have done it faster if we knew, if we knew, and come on, you'd do the same for us. Yeah, I mean, I sure would have done it faster. In a heartbeat. Now even I think the party fell incomplete without Carl. He does grow on people fast. Best, how did it feel when you took the blast? 
purposeful, like I was doing the right thing. Forever indebted to you for that. You brought hope to my world and crowned me champion of the arena. As far as I'm concerned, it is you. It is I who still owes you. Fair enough. Can't help but wonder why Rashan wouldn't just save Garl in the first place. If that was his wish. We'll never know for sure, but I think he needed Valera and Jill to be ready for something. Seems to me like these alchemists are just incredibly immature for all their millennia of experience. He needed them to go through that. What to say? Shame Rashan left. I hope I can thank him someday. I wouldn't presume to understand the great alchemist's mind, but I believe it, it is he who meant to thank you. Hmm. Good to have my boy back. We want eight and slept better at that night than they had since the fight against the Dweller of Strife. So what's this errand he was talking about? Should we just climb this level for all time's sake? Come on girl. Let's see what the Elder Mist has to say. guy. Nothing special. I wonder though, like what what did get leveled up for Garl? I realize that's a bit overkill, could have just hit them. Let's do the shrine. Yes, could have just done that. 42 experience. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so this is done. Yes. Let us see what the Elder Mist has to say. I also want to go to the village.
I mean, we were just here, but let's see what the villagers have to say. Kind of left, just go camping. Oh, it's resurrected, yeah. I'm glad they did something with that, though. Like, they actually say something. He's technically a zombie now. Huh? Oh, he came back to life. Is there anything Garl hasn't done? Like, Garl's legend is gonna be bigger than the Solstice of Boreas. And uh, most of them say, uh, they say pretty much the same. said what his whole errand was about though like his wish Let's see what the headmaster Did you not say anything? The hell. Should probably go to the spa. Don't have enough money for it though, but... Let's see if I can sell some stuff. He actually has decent weapon on. Moon Cradle Boys Lair. Should also probably give him some other things. Handcraft in a realm unknown, using materials unknown. Stats are in the hundreds, so that's good. Let me just give him some more MP since he also has the heal. Okay, let's go to the spa. Take yourself to a relaxing time enveloped in the stunning. Uh, Gotta treat him like to some good times. Oh, took it all in at first, but soon thought of something he wanted to tell Sarai. 
Despite his lack of concentration, he enjoyed the ex enjoyed the experience overall and appreciated how good it felt to be give, it, give his feet a break. I wanted to tell something to Sarai. Okay. Glad I did not read those achievements. Because that would have just spoiled the whole surprise. You have an in here. This one? Yes. There's this thing that I wanted to share. So I'm not allowed to talk about what I saw on the other side. But when it became clear that I would return, I was allowed to make a single wish. Right. What did you ask for? Dinner with all my friends at the Golden Pelican. Oh yeah? Sure did. I'm going to host my own reverse funeral and I want the best food. Oh yeah. Thing is though, I'm not too sure how that works. All I was given is this fishing book. Book of time. I'm sure we'll figure it out. He already said that. Okay. Is that like the island where we just found the last conch that has like the question marks? Because it also has like something in the lake there. So maybe we can use the hook of time over there. Something on screen now for the stream. To be very professional. That's the way I am. Be right back. Quick toilet break. And I'm back. Headset back on. The 
game back on. There we go. No sound. I was a... like I saw them playing, but I didn't hear any music as soon as I changed it. I've also been in the last couple of days when I also was looking for treasure in the conscious I was also like playing the wheels game just because it was like so annoying right like when you ask the parrot on the map like hey what's left on this island you would like get like oh wheels player wheels player like I know but that's not the one I'm seeking like shut up about the wheels players so yeah, I did a bunch of them, still have not done all of them, not even sure if that uh, does uh, even unlock anything, but let's see, a special hook given to Garl by entities unknown only to him. Entities beyond death. Like, what are they supposed to be? Like, even greater gods? Or... Oh, yeah, let's go and see what this is about. If I'm correct in my guess. Reclame ah, finally the... I did see a white sparkle there. Nobody has anything to say about that. Okay. Notice that. Damn. Okay. Does not give a lot of XP though. Checking around. Let's see what this is about first. Is this the way outside? Yeah. 
fishing dungeon key. Okay. No idea what that is about. That's a whole lot better as XP. What is the fishing dungeon? Though? Fishing dungeon D opens a door in the fishing dungeon. Is this the fishing dungeon we are in right now? Did we just get the key before we encountered the door? Is the door up ahead? Ah. Okay. Just did things out of order then. The glowing one is the key. All you have to do is catch it. There's a fish shaped keyhole behind the statue. That's where you put the glowing one. Let me guess, this would also be impossible to catch without the, the right rod. Does not seem to want to bite. Maybe you need to catch all of the other ones. Guessing I need to do any catch all of them.
just need to jump in to get it. It's a key. We have no idea what's waiting for us. Bit of hook shot to that wall, but I wanna like swim around a little bit so I make sure I don't miss anything. Garl's whole wish is to be like, like he could wish for anything. Shouldn't he have wished for something better than to just have dinner with everyone in the Golden Pelican? Like when he said like, oh, I, I, I want to talk to Sarai about something, but like uh, maybe he wished for them to be like people again, but... a big boy. What the fuck? Hey, chef face. Well, well, well. Look what you've done, what you've gone and done. Hey, Mr. Sorry, it's just uh, I was given this. Easy now, son. I'm leading this conversation. There's one thing I know for sure, it's that you need the hook of time to get in here. And if there's another thing I know for sure, is that they don't just up and give the hook of time to anyone. I just ask, really? Right. I get it. I also got the return. Point is, they must have liked you a lot. Oh, I don't know about that. The oblivious type, huh? Fine, I'll bite. What exactly did you ask for? I just wanted dinner with my friends at the Golden Pelican in Risk. Huh? That does change everything, doesn't it? Do you know about the place? I know about it. I built it myself. Really? Chef base at your service. No way, you're the chef? In the flesh. So, uh, can we have the dinner? <laughs> be quite too disappointed if I said no at this point, huh? Yeah, it would be. You and your friends are officially invited. How many will be attending? How many can we be? It's your wish, son. Tell me. You tell me. This is too much. 
Okay, let's see. Definitely all of us here. Plus Amalcom, Teeks, and the Pirates. A bad Marine, which you have too. Be 12 of us, if, it's, mm -hmm. if that's okay. Good on you for making it, making it count. Right on. How does it work? Do we just show up at the Golden Pelican? Mm -hmm. Yeah, you do. And then we give you this, and then you give this to Gaspar. Gilded invitation. This is exciting. Thanks, Chef Face. You got it. This is like such a weird way to go about this. Right, that brings us back to the beginning, I'm guessing. I bet this brings us back to like the small pool outside of the dungeon. So it's like a really small pond outside of the fishing pond. Yeah, I knew it. Gold Pelican better be the most divine thing you can eat eat at because make you actually waste a wish like that. Uh, let's see, where was it again? I knew it uh, somewhere at the top of the map. Right here? Yes, it is. To the Golden Pelican. Do you have a reservation for today? Oh, a private invitation from our chef. You will need proper attire for this specification. Please gather the other guests. Our tailors will be right with you. The bow tie, please. Excellent choice, sir. I think it looks great in here. Zeal looks like a cowboy. Please sit still, Mr. Melkwood. We are almost finished. Do we get to keep the outfits? Anything for you, pal? There's a reason why Fancy ain't my middle name, but it's like Valtred said. This is so special. Look, Mal look at Malcolm Mud. Beloved guest, a moment of your attention. Dinner is ready to be served. Please follow me. Yes, sir. Good chef, right away. Such a strange world. Oh, yeah. Please enjoy. Should there be anything else you need, just let me know. Thanks. Naturally. Ah, look at Valer. She looks so nice. Yes. You gotta do the honor spell. Oh. I don't know. This is all. This is, this is about all of us. I think we should just dig in. Elder Moraine, was it? I am sure you understand tradition demands that. Of course. Ahem. Attention, please. gathered here 
today to mark the return of someone truly special. You're not even wait for him to finish. Then they let me keep the fourth. Well, that sure was nice of them. And you repaid you re and you repaid this kind as a thousandfold. As a bit of an elemental mage myself, I must say your work there was quite the impressive feat. Oh, I only did it for girl. Yeah, you all did so much for me, a lot more than I could ask for. She looks cute. We do more, we could. More than bringing me back to life. I'd like to see that. <laughs> and Zeal looks pretty, yeah, pretty. He actually does look a bit like a cowboy. In spite of, all, of it all, you still gave a whole lot more than you took, son. Good on you. To girl. Can't believe how lucky I am to have all of you. I guess the final battle awaits. But we can worry about that tomorrow. Let's just make the best of this time. It'd be nice if they revived him to give him his eye, the eye back. Uh, whatever. Uh, Gaspar? Sir? Too late now for me to make a toast? Whatever you fancy, this is your moment. Okay. Okay, let's see here. Thank you, my dear friends, for joining me in celebration. Tonight I raise my glass above my heart. The cheeks for our unwavering support and unquenchable thirst for knowledge. To Malcomot for teaching us that one can always turn their life around, no matter their age. To Malcomot. To Yolanda, Baltrade and Kinatan for their spirit of adventure. And for always keeping their eyes on the target, no matter how dire things get. Ah, they just get bundled in, huh? To Moraine for standing firm in the face of insurmountable grief and never wavering in his faith. And never wavering in his faith in my friends. To Sarai for enduring the impossible and being the coolest person I know. Sean and Best for saving my life. Finally to Valer and Zill for getting me out of Book Cradle and letting me travel the world to encounter countless wonders. But most importantly for being the best friends anyone could ask for. Amen. This work, the abundance of food and good times with his loved ones, gave Garl an epiphany, the ultimate meal. Recipe, legendary feast. Question pack 11. And... been kind of nice if you could like keep their outfits as like separate ones Bill, uh, I'll also set something like in the spa he had something to tell Valer, or had to, to, had to tell Sarai, I mean. I still wonder what that was about.
Thought the exit was over there. Just blindly walking. Okay, let's go and get on the ship. And maybe see if we can get some more dialogue on the ship. Because sometimes more on the ship happens than like at a camp. The time I asked or talked to that Sean was also on this ship when he pointed me towards the Skylands. Shame that Sean left. Hope I can thank him someday. Kind of weird that that dialogue popped up while they're not here with me. in his place. The golden pelican was everything I was hoping for. Very nice. Legendary feast is ultimate recipe. This legendary feast we have here is one we found in the Flashmancer's castle first time uh, we went through it but that actually didn't happen yet right because you're let you go back to the last save point uh, before the fight so you could say that it now makes sense that it's girl ultimate recipe because I think I complained a little bit when we first found it I'm like how can this be girl's ultimate recipe he died before we even found a recipe for this. Like, uh, how does that make sense? But yeah, now it does. Time travel on Funari. Yeah. Time 47, damn. Yeah, gold collected, 6,600 fish caught, means good. Still have one achievement here that we don't have. New Gaul Plus. That was like one of the hidden ones. Every recipe at least once. And unlock all the combos. Still need to find six treasures, unlock the combos, and cook every recipe at least once. Okay. Maybe we can get that done right now. Feels kind of wasteful though to eat like. So we definitely made this, we made this, we made this, we did made this. Not sure about this one anymore. I wanna say we made it. We definitely made this. So Shaw 3. Let's keep that in mind. Row sandwich we made. We made this. We made it. Mushroom soup, moon cradle fish pies. So Shadri and Hardy stew. I'm not sure about how this. I think we did make a peach strudel before. We definitely made this and this. Not sure about the parfait. Don't think we ever made this one. You know we had some sashimi, but I don't know if we made it. Yakitori shrimp we did make. Tataki, no, not sure about. Not 
champion omelet. Teen we made. We do have his legendary feast, but we never made it before. Still no achievement, okay. I do know we also have one of these, but I don't think we've also made this before. Also still not, don't have all the recipes. That's something I'll probably do off screen also. Don't think it's all that big of a deal. we can do yes we can I got the question back be delivering that okay, I'm not gonna look up the answers right away let's see if we can do the ultimate one the quiz the first time. Do you want to play? Yes. Because I also did like you know, a lot of this off screen. You don't really got anything special for it. Like I did all the expert ones. Even went out of my way to get uh, number 7. Let's do 11. And let's do the casual one. Since you can make some mistakes. What number is obtained by putting together the base and P cost of Moonarang and Dastray? Then subtracting the cost of Petrichor. I think Moonarang is 7, Dastray is 7, so that's 14. And Petrichor is 12, I believe, so 2. Yes, okay. Alright, next question. Okay. By the way, I swear, all the previous questions, I admit, I think I even said it at the time in the video, I did have like a cheat sheet. I don't have one now. Which of the Fleshmancer Acolytes gave Duke Aventry the magic shard that would summon the Night's Shroud? I think this was in one of Teeks' stories about it, about it, but I'm not sure. I'm just gonna say it was one, but... So, okay, next question. After focusing Averol on a diversion, Sean placed an anchor in time linked to a magic device. He would later place in the Moorlands. What is the device called? Chrono Bridge. We just did that. Okay. What was the name of the one in charge of the team that built? What's the name of the one in charge of the team that built Estris Day? That's the one in the... Sarai's world, right? The one that was holding the block. I am not sure about this. I know that this one is like one of the giants who throws. But then, I'm just gonna say. Tigor, okay. Alright, next question. When fighting the gun goddess, how many bullets would be fired by Panda Hammer? If two had previously been destroyed. <laughs> I don't even think we have s we seen that.
gonna say, like, she holds up six bullets, right? And two had been destroyed, so four. Alright, next question. In this pursuit... In his pursuit to achieve the great alchemical feat known as Living Glass, what was the one ingredient Rashan had always been missing in his subject? Unbreakable will, unfathomable strength, unwavering courage, unbreakable will. which item had to be given to a ghost in order to obtain the key that unlocked the shed. That was the turbo cookie. <laughs> oh, you are good. Here's a little something for that impressive performance. Got the sapphire ore. Okay, let me do the, this one again, but then the expert one. Which of these areas appeared first in Valer and Jail's adventure? Um, I think Glacial Peak was first. Out of all those. Next question. When playing wheels, which of these units deals the most damage to the enemy ball? Guessing a level 2 warrior, right? Yeah. Right, next question. And Lucent, which item had to be given to a ghost in order to obtain the key? Okay, yeah, we just had this one. So the questions for casual and expert are not different. There are maybe some, well, some are d different. It's like a pool. Score one for Valer. Next question. Breakable will again. Think twenty three. Next question. Decor. The right answer. of the best matches. First answer to one. That was the wrong answer to two. Two. Oh man, thanks. Alright, next question. After focusing a again. It was this one, Joshu. Josh, yeah. This question I'm fighting the gun goddess who had been destroyed before. The ancient battle between the Molkin mages and the Kunusnuku zealots. What is the name used to refer to the moment when the Great Serpent appeared? Was it not like the Great Summoning? I'm surprised I remembered that. Next question. So that's two, right? Just a little something. Sapphire ring. Achieve pro rank in every single... I did get an achievement just now. Still, like, that's all you get for completing that? Do I need to, like, complete all of them on casual too?
casual too to get like a special reward. Sarai's world now. I'm so curious about that thing what Garl said. Like maybe you could have gone to the spa way sooner. That's why he said that. Like just some built-in dialogue, but just one thing. Anything we can do here. Thing. Need to set up a camp to in this world to have anything be said about it. Same dialogue. Basically everything's the same. It's just too good. Yeah. Still got nothing. Okay. And then I'm guessing we will just go ahead and do the final battle again. Rest. I did just remember though, like there's still one thing I don't know what it's for. The flimsy hammer. Kinda scared to look it up because I don't want any spoiler it, but finding that out for yourself is like the best, but it, the item doesn't even give me any description. Very flimsy. Okay. To the gross flesh pork. saved over there but probably better to save here let's see how this final battle goes this time
I mean, I guess it does work for build up, but goddamn, man, couldn't they have just made the stairs any bit shorter? Like, giving us an elevator? Congratulations, you have been made to do since. Prepare yourself. Prepare myself? <laughs> you foolish child. Fighting solstice warriors is beneath me. You did make it all the way here, so I will play by the rules. The time has come to decide on the fate of your realm and, and all of its worlds. Can you defeat my strongest lieutenant? Who will see re reign supreme over the cyborgs? Never. Your evil has no place here anymore. My, have we grown both. Let's go. Oh, you champion. Hey. You coward. Ah, so this is different. How about fighting your own battles for a change? <laughs> you. All you do is corrupt everything you touch and make people suffer. I'm kicking you out. You would challenge a god? God? I told you once, you son of a creep. You're nothing but a loser. And so the fool repeats his mistake. There will be no time travel track saving you this time. Come then. Come then. Eternal pain awaits. <clears throat> oh, yo. Blast him as hard as we can. Two thirty-five. Let's set up the shield. No, that's just attack. That's like a lot of damage.
Just use skill. Just use Sunball again. I think Rashawn revives next turn. Then I can use the light man on the floor. Oh, I guess he does not. Okay, fuck me then. Single target, blunt venom in the crayon. Let's just do this then. I don't think we've even seen this one. Damn. Much we can do about that. Should swap back to the Solstice War still. Feels kinda wrong to not have them on the field in such an important battle. Wish we had this one. Now, okay, let me just do Lunar Shield this time now. Seems like an appropriate moment. Let's see what he has. Maul. Okay. Nice. surprised he managed to survive that. Let's do the ultimate. Just deal out some massive damage. Not as much as I th had hoped. Would have probably been better to you. that skill? No, she can't. And just swap back to the Shion. Let's just do this. Flash, I mean, what would you expect with someone with the name of Flashman, sure, but still, fucking gross. This one, weak against Lunar, sword attacks. Sadly, can't see what their health is anymore.
would it be bad? I just gonna do this. Such an awkward position. Why did she go and stand all the way over there? Just takes her eye out since she does blade damage. Nice. Overkill, but can never be too sure. That's hard to time at the You know what, fuck it, just go for it. I still don't have the timing for that down since I don't use it much, but it's so useful sometimes. Holy crap, that attack is also so fast.
gonna say, like, what is happening? Now we get this whole deal again. What the? Ow. Oof. Oh, fuck yeah. Could I, could I have ended it just then? But I failed at the last second? Or did we go back anyway uh, because I succeeded? Still did damage through the shield. That's kind of bullshit. Just throw up another shield. Get a bit more of a heal going again. This seems to be a good time for Sarai ultimate. Prioritize healing her. Get some MP back. Let's deal some damage with Sarai.
That's so crazy. Like it still does uh, damage through the shield. Like does the shield tank nothing? Why should I? Yeah, I mean, that was kind of uh, unavoidable, but... Uh, let's just get our combo up as much as we can. Feel there's like much point in attacking these things since they are so damage resistant. I don't think you can even do enough damage to them to get them down before they transform. Do have any other combo? So fucking gross. Jesus fucking Christ, leave her alone. Sorry if I'm like hesitating, I'm like just trying to think about what would be the best thing to do. I can only use Valera anyway, so I'll give I'll set up another lunar shield. Papa for help.
much health as this piece of shit had. Set up a lunar shield again for everyone because after this he's just gonna do his normal attack again, which almost one shots everybody. Holy shit! Rashan has three uh, of those things around him. Let's just use one. Aim for Zeal again, please. Still does damage, like, so crazy. Can I get Sarai in and... No, of course not. Sarai and Valer, he moved shit, which does not even do a multi-hit. Guess I'll just do that then. And use my ultimate to get rid of this. I want to attack, but healing is probably more important. Second live mana thing on the floor, and I know, we could just use the X strike, right? Let's do that. Oh, 
Okay, here we go again. Be a big fan of the whole dive mechanic, though. Okay, we got his help down there again. Like, how many phases does this battle have? Like, geez. There's like a defense buffing item we could use right now. Well, just heal himself. I could use uh, Lunar Shield again, but I feel like it barely helps. Like, it doesn't help. Use Disorient again, though. Damage versus one target. You know what? Let's just go for it. Don't use this one all that often. Kind of disappointing damage. Uh, for a combo thing that costs as much as it does, the uh, one with Rashan and Zeal is much better. This is nice though. Good timing. Great damage, but actually managed to break his guard, which I feel is like almost just as important in this game, right? Breaking all the locks. gonna put him in and because I think he can take a hit better than Sarai can
42, pretty good damage actually. Ah. An attack that has so much build up, it's like not as bad as his normal ones. Nonsense again. Thank you for being with us again, Zoo. Now I can use the group you. Is this battle supposed to be this long or do I need to do something special? Both of them are weak to blunt damage, okay. Yeah, go ahead and eat a gourmet burger. This one is much better than the other one. Oh, go. 
God of Mine. Just got an achievement called No God of Mine. How is this possible? How? Better start believing. We're kicking you out. Damn. Fucking girl with the smackdown. That's it? Let me help you, buddy. Get up. He doesn't deserve to escape. He deserves to die. Okay. Also, in the, this version, we fight the Flashmancer himself. But in this version, we didn't fight Irlina. So what is it? What what happens to her? He's gone. Also, Bragaves. Don't know what happened to him. He's he's really gone. We're free. Hope. Oh, it's been so long. Villa two. We have to go right now and face the world leader. Will you return? they ever like uh, talk about this world leader coming up before because we knew it was a thing right? like leave a dweller alone for too long and it becomes a world leader but this seems feels kind of random we can feel everything now there's just so much for us to do so many words I had no idea this is goodbye then. Ah oh, man, come on, I was like hoping for a better ending. I guess so best thing. Oh, stop being so dramatic. Ah. Just promise you'll visit from time to time, okay? Hey. Of course. That's more like it. We'll see you soon, girl. First we I know. You do your Luana and Solon stuff whenever you have to. But you always be Valer and Zeal to me. Wouldn't want it any other way. Serious seriously, we did something good here. You guys are the best. Man, such a supporting friend. Oh, go on then. And don't ever miss my birthday. You can count, ah, uh, like in the previous ending when Garl was still dead. They flew by Earth every... That's what they said, that's what the legend was at, at least. Like they flew by Earth every time on girl's birthday. You can count on it. Promise? Promise. Well, we should. Hey, this is also different. Wait! This is different, right? No, this this did happen. Before you could go, could I just right? Wait, no, you. I'll make so sure future generation. Know your story and remember you always. It's been great knowing you as well, Tix. Please stay safe. It's not about us anymore. You take good care of yourself and your people, okay? We'll do our best in our in your memory. Like stop talking as if they're dying. It's time to go over there. They did even promise to come back, right? And so our watch begin. He is hoping it won't be too boring. That'd be a first. Yeah. Hey, don't wait too long before your first visit. Fighting by your side has been my life's honor.
this guy any different? Does not seem like it. Should have saved it for the this one. Also, that last hit is always a bit, a bit bullshit, right? Because you can't move after you kill it. Okay, we've already seen credits before. With cool and okay, super speed. I think this is new, right? The spa. Also, no idea what that robot thing there was, but. This one we've seen. is also new plus a best going to the elder mist That is the last time, but even with the ultra speed, the credits take this long. Like, geez, man. It's just dancing, like, so unlike her serious self, so. That's really nice. 
am a bit disappointed though, like that we do, couldn't do anything for, like any more for them. They're just stuck in their robot bodies. Like, man, come on. That's what makes a story, like, kind of good, I guess. There needs to be some tragedy involved still. Like, even some people would not like... Hey, this is new. That guy is from the messenger. That's Erlina. Did we fight Erlina in the messenger? Do not remember. I'd have to look that up. It's many years later again. And so we gather each year as they fly by our work. They fly by our boat, their never-ending watch, and together we remember their story. Ice Age? Yes. Is it true they always fly in on the warrior cook's birthday? Oh, absolutely. Quite fitting, don't you think? Now run, uh, run along everyone, I must check in on the crypt reven renovations. Thank you. Thinking about Yamada's notes, you know, about the flood. No, the window, the big window, extra thick. Well, do you like the central piece? It's, it's perfect. Did we also get here in the messenger? You'll be late if you don't leave soon. Oops. Yeah, I guess I should head out. That's badass, his friend the dragon. Hey, old friend. Wentworth. Happy birthday, master. For the millionth time, please stop calling me that. Are you ready to go then? Yeah, can't be late. I know it's not a focus of the game, but is there like any romance involved at all? Like, did Carl never get married or find a wife or anything? I kind of like the. I personally kind of like the idea of him in Sarai or maybe him in Valer. Like, not Valer and Zale, because they feel more like twins, right? Like, not as a couple. Just right. No time. They still haven't changed much. Come on, don't be shy now. <laughs> Such a nice ending. I guess Valer and Zeal are pretty much gods now. They don't age. Got flimsy hammer. Another flimsy hammer. Still don't know what those are for. Like, I might have to look it up. Okay, let's just start the game. Continue. See what's 
we leave off. Like I'm guessing before the flash manager. Yeah. Okay. So yeah, I'm gonna end it here. I've been like streaming for almost three hours, two hours and forty-seven minutes. It says at the moment. Um, I also have some other stuff to do. Otherwise, it would just keep going. I will look up and see what you can do with those flimsy hammers. I'm just surprised there's still more to this game, eh, to be honest. And yeah, my, if it's like something substantial, I will come back and do another stream slash recording. And yeah, finish this game off. I haven't had any viewers today or and nobody in chat at least so if you're watching this on youtube thank you for watching don't forget to leave a like and subscribe you know all the usual and yeah until the next video bye